channel and if you are new then welcome to my channel. In today's video I am starting a new series of trying famous lipsticks. So for today's video I am actually trying Faces Canada All Time Pro um, lip crayons. These are called as Intense Matte Lips Plus Primer and when I did my favorite lipsticks collection of 2019 a lot of you guys recommended me the shade T Rose. For some reason whenever I say T Rose it just sounds wrong in my head. I mean, it sounds wrong as in I feel like I'm pronouncing it wrong, but it is T Rose. Maybe I'm just saying it too fast. Anyways, pointless talks, I tell you. Uh, so, yeah, I picked up two of the shades. Now, I'm someone who cannot just buy like five, six shades of lipsticks if I don't know how the formula is because I end up not using them at all. So, I have like I have bought so many lipsticks like that without even trying the formula like five six shades and then I never ended up using it so now I'm just trying to make smart choices um, so yeah I actually picked up two shades one is in the shade T Rose of course and I think the other is obsessed if I'm not wrong yes obsessed isn't this like the most satisfying thing about new products ever like I love removing the plastic coating, especially if it comes off in like one go that's the best part okay so i have the product here by the way if you guys feel like i look a little different my makeup is incomplete that is true you are absolutely right i'm actually going to film uh, a few looks with the lacme eyeshadow palette so i've kept it bare because otherwise i'll have to remove it after this video which i don't want to do so that's why this incomplete look because anyways this is just a lipstick video so i don't think this matters i'm so excited you guys have created such a hype about this shade like so many of you recommended me the shade and i was like okay then oh my god they just right off the bat just twisting it up i can see that this looks like something i'm going to love you guys actually know my lipstick choice i was trying um the new maybelline liquid lipsticks and when i swatched one of the shades someone commented that this is so your shade and i was like yes you know me <laughs> I don't, know. I don't know why that comment made me really happy. Anyways, I'm just blabbering. Let's try. I'm excited. Okay. Oh wow. I see. I see. I see. I see why you guys love it. Oh my god. That's such a pretty shade. It's so beautiful. Oh my god. Oh my god, it is going on so smoothly. Wow. Formula is also very nice. Most of the uh, crayons that I've been trying lately, they go on like a proper uh, cream finish and then they settle down into matte. Which I mean is not a bad thing at all. But I mean, I would rather pick up a formula which is kind of like this, which doesn't go on as a cream finish. But so far so good. I love the shade you guys. Oh my god. Thank you so much. You guys are the best when it comes to like picking up shades. So I think it's going very well with the color bar blush that I have. The Cheek Illusion one. Um, oh my god. I actually don't feel like doing anything with my eyes now because I love how this is looking. Super super comfortable. I don't have any complaints. It went on very smoothly. There's nothing patchy or anything at all. So I took it off and now let's try the shade Obsessed. Actually this shade also looks super super nice. Let me let me like open and twist it up and show you this. Oh wow. I'm actually so glad that I picked up these two shades. These are just like my shades. These are the kind of shades that I like to wear. Let's try it on. Oh wow. <laughs> What's happening to me? Oh my god. This, on the other hand, is a little more bold. Has a very nice terracotta um, kind of undertone. It's actually a proper terracotta burnt orange sort of color. Oh my god, you guys, the formula is so good. I'm actually gonna like zoom in and then show you how this is applied.
this is the shade obsessed and I think you guys could see how beautifully it went on it goes on with like a proper not extremely matte powdery finish but actually a matte finish uh, let's see how much it transfers okay it does transfer quite a bit uh, but yeah this is the shade oh my god I'm in love I'm in love with both of the shades it's so pretty it's so beautiful I have a feeling this is going to last pretty well so yeah so far so good Hi guys, okay, um, this is going to be the outro for this video. For some reason, this video was just pending because I just wasn't getting any chance to record the outro portion of it. Now, for the lasting part, it lasts beautifully. That's what I was expecting anyways, uh, just based on how this applied and everything. Um, it leaves a very like faint tint on your lips uh, at the end of the day, so that's very nice. Um, I did not get a chance to again record that. I was extremely busy this past week. But yeah, overall, it's a great, great lipstick formula, amazing pigmentation, very comfortable on the lips. I really love the formula as well as the shades, of course. You guys know how much I loved these two shades. So uh, if you guys have any more recommendations in the shades for this lipstick collection, please let me know in the comment section below. Uh, so yeah, if you are actually looking forward to trying these shades, you can definitely go ahead and do so without any fear. You're not going to waste your money. The formula is really good. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry the intro is like this. I just wasn't getting the chance to sit down and film. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.